Hello everyone, my name is Bultramax. I don't know why I keep saying that. Of course you know my name is Bultramax, right? Why is my camera still not good? I don't care, just leave it be. Welcome back to the cat lady, guys. Uh, I found out what to do, I actually found out what to do a week ago. But I haven't had the chance or the motivation to play it because it is a rather... Sometimes I'm like, what do I need to do in this game? And then I like, okay, I don't play it for a time. And then, okay, let's do it again. That didn't make any sense, did it? But anyway, I found out what to do. I took a shard of glass from this mirror over here. And now we are going to bell for that stupid woman again. Get your ass over here. Quick. Because I have some glass. Someone is coming. Good. Let's stab her with the glass. Now we're actually not gonna do that. Oh, are your you glasses are so is ugly. There an emergency? Yes, I want to stab you. Uh, give me medication. How? I pressed it by mistake. Sorry. I just want to remind you that I'm ready to. I'm feeling a bit woozy. Give me some meds. You really? Yes. You look fine to me. I'm not. No, I I'm really not feeling well. Give me those meds. Fine. I'll call the doctor for you. But I can't help it if he's busy and can't get here straight away. In the meantime, I know how to make you feel better. I think it's time we give you some medication. Yes, give Can me those drugs. Tell me your name and your date of birth. 1 of uh, 1st of August 1995. Oh wait, that's mine actually. Are you kidding me? There we Susan go. Susan Ashworth, 24th of May, 1970. I'm just going to check your name band now to confirm that. What, you think I'm lying? I'm lying. Don't touch me. That's fine. Good. That's fine. I'd like you to drink this. Why do you say it twice? It will help you relax. It will help you relax. Why are you repeating yourself? Take drugs. Don't touch me, I just said that. That's a good girl. Now, drink it down. You'll feel much better. Okie doke, there we go. Hacha! Okay, guys. This is what I needed to do. My camera's all smudged up, but I can't touch it because I am afraid I will knock it down. You'll be able to relax and have a great sleep. No! I'm not going to my room. Whoa! Look at that sexy face. Come on, there we go. We have the piece of glass or the shard, I don't know. Those sounds, man, it sounds like someone's having a good time on their own, if you know what I mean. <laughs> Alright, so this heart over here, which looks like a spider, we are going to take the glass, use it, and freaking stab the life out of it. Kill it! Haha! <laughs> and now we go back to our room, I think. Right? Or do we not? Let me examine this heart for a second. So hard to concentrate. Is this thing filled with drugs? I don't know. So what do I do now? Do I just go back to my bed? There we go. Run. We can run for a bit. That's cool. Is it running? It is. A bit. Seems more like she's falling over or something. Haha! -ha! Let me use my medication part. Uh, I will fill it with this drug. And then swallow it in my anus. Drink. I've had enough drugs already. Drink this will probably kill me. Okay. So now we go back to our room. Did that happen before those sounds? I don't remember. Creep me out. Okie do. Lay down. There we go. Beautiful knockout. Beautiful knockout by Mike Tyson. Why am I saying these things? I don't know. Mike Tyson is one crazy motherfucker. Okay, so now I probably take these drugs. It looks like blood, but I don't care. The drugs have worn off and I feel better now. Good. But I can't let them do that to me again. I need to get out of here. Alrighty. So we take the drugs. What is it exactly? Pardon me. And how did I get it? It's all a bit blurry. I can't really remember much. Drink. I've had enough drugs already. Damn. Give. There's no one here. <gasps> Ooh, we're going to drug the 
thing on the hallway. Huh. Hello, lady. Would you like some drugs? There you go. Please, just leave me alone. Mother's always told me not to accept any gifts from strangers. I'm not a stranger. I just want to share my drugs with you. Okay, so who do I give it to? Is there someone else I give it to? Oh! This is something else I remember. But was it the correct way? No, 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 no. Don't do it. I need mirror. Examine. I can't look at myself. I've so seen something about this that um, Harshly Critical was playing this game as well. And he turned on the sink. And then something... Whoa, what's happening? Aha! Isle. Oh, wait. <gasps> That's the name of her mother. Of course. Yes. I am a genius. Come on. Susan, that's your name. Come on, let's go to this lady over here. It's Isle. That's an ugly ass name, but still. If you really are the yes. That I Isle, Sheila. Isle. How did I get the name Sheila then? Sheila. Sheila. Yes. It was my mother who sent you, after all. I'm sorry I didn't believe you. But my head's all messed up. Good, now here, take my drugs. So, let's have a little chat, sweetheart. Do you know how to get out of here? Something's wrong with this place. Do you know how to get out of here? Do you? You're supposed to get out. I don't we care. Must stay here. Do what they say. Take pills they give us. Sometimes, if I behave, they give me the red stuff. I wait for it. I'm being good. Here's the red what stuff. I've got this red stuff. I've got some red it's stuff for drug. you. My favorite one. Red stuff takes the pain away. Oh, that's nice. I must stay here. Good nurses have been most kind. They always remember. They know I'm suffering. But it is not the same as the drugs I see in my dreams. On the other side of the mirror, there's a spider's heart full of drugs. I have seen that one. I just can't seem to find it anymore. I killed it. I'm sorry. I see. Are you right? Feel like sharing? What's your name? How about we swap our name bands? <laughs> what exactly is this little treat you meant? What exactly is this little treat you mentioned? It's the red teardrop of pure happiness. They bring it. <laughs> All I right. Drink it and my pain. Beautiful. Without it, I, it's like I'm going crazy. I just uh -huh. get so fucking angry sometimes. Okay, don't hit me, please. I we're have dying. those drugs. We're all dying. She said I'd go to hell for it. I didn't know. Okay, I got know? your drugs. No, who? God, Him. no. God doesn't know, no. Right. I Stop need talking. Medicine. Yes. I must be a good girl. Maybe I can. Oh, they have it. Or well, maybe. I can. I see it, but in my. I see it. Shh. Ah. Oh, uh. yeah, they're all. Okay. Poor woman. Don't not no no. She's not a poor woman. I've got red stuff for you, lady. Look at this. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Lovely red this stuff. Red stuff you were talking about, but are you absolute? Don't be silly. Fine. How about you? Oh, I don't care about yeah. the talking. Take it. What did I take? Did I take her armband? Thank you for your help. Dunk. And he's banned. Oh my god. Now I can leave this motherfucking hospital. Alright guys, welcome back. Open the lid. Gloves. Use. Who in the right mind would think of something like this? Seriously. Just tell me. I mean, I get the whole idea of getting gloves. But who would think of using those gloves to flush the toilet so you can take the discharge card and get out of this hospital? Seriously. Who made this game? Who made the puzzles? 
How high is this IQ? But anyway, Someone is coming. we're getting out of this hospital. This episode, I'm not spending another episode in this freaking hospital, guys. Have you rang Stupid the bell? camera. Is there an Still not good. The toilet's blocked. What? Ah, oh, well, that's hardly an emergency. It is when you need to use it urgently. Stupid. I see. Just give me a. Stop talking. Ah, oh, it's the gloves again. I guess I'll have to get my hands dirty since the cleaner's called in. Good. Ha <laughs> Suck on that! Stupid red glass! Biatch! Let's take the discharge card and get out of this building! Finally! I've literally play been playing for half an hour? More? No? Wait, half an hour, yes. Take. And I haven't made any progress at all. Sorry, Mark. We'll need here. Yes. Uh, can I just check your name? Oh, all right. Uh, there you go. Can I? Of course. We'll see you. Yeah. Yeah. No. 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 Get out of my way, you bald man. Stupid bald man. Ha ha. Get out of this building. Employees only. Fuck that. I'm getting out of here. Exit. Hi, doctor. And you must be so Um... Yes, I am. Well... Do you mind if I ask you where you're heading to? I was just going for a little walk. Stretch... No! Give it a rest. I'm not going anywhere. Miss Ashworth, please relax. There's been a mistake. You have been prescribed wrong medication. I apologize sincerely on behalf of my team and the hospital, but luckily we managed to spot it on time. On time? You have no idea what I've been through? Once again, I'm truly sorry. I promise no more drugs will be given to you. I personally guarantee you will have a good, peaceful sleep tonight, and you can be discharged in the morning. Oh, Why can't luckily. I go tonight? I want to go now! I'm really sorry, but we can't legally discharge suicidal patients without a full psychiatric assessment. It's too late for it now, but I promise we'll have a chat in my office, and then you can go... I haven't really got much choice. Now I'd like to ask you some questions about your life, Susan. You might find them fine. Let's get it over with then, shall we? Yes, please. No more talking. At last. Of course, I understand. He understands. So, Susan, let's see. Let's see. I'm going to talk for them Are because they're too slow. At the yes. I live on my own. I don't need any. Sometimes they annoy me or upset me. I'm happy with how things are at the moment. I have my little bit of space. And it's my own. It's private. I'd like to keep it that way. What do you do for a live? Nothing. I'm a waitress. I'm a waitress. You do? Do you like it? It's okay. I don't mind it. It's just a job. It's important to keep busy. I'd advise you get back to work as soon as next week. I will. Okay, though. Describe to me what your mornings look like. Bloody. What is the first thing you do each day? I drink strong coffee. I eat breakfast. I have a cup of tea. I lie in bed awake. Can bring myself to... Oh, Go to the toilet, doesn't everyone? I put the TV on so I can watch my old TV shows. I drink strong I drink coffee. Strong coffee. I know it's not a great start for the... But it's one of my little pleasures in life that I find very hard to say no to. Would you say that you feel safer at home than outside? Yes. I, it's not really about safe. I've just felt sad for a long time now. Somehow it brings me down even more when I go out and see all those happy success. It makes me feel more like a failure. If I don't see it, it doesn't hurt that much. What do you think is missing in your life? Or rather, money what is one thing that you a lot think of money. Make your life better. 
A good friend. That would be nice to have <laughs> money. It would be nice to have more money, I guess. Sure. That's not about money, of guys. Course. Don't we all? Yes. Now I'm going to adjust this camera have because that's been pissing me off. Group therapy for depression. No. No. Especially the group therapy thing. I'd hate it. You should at least give it a go first, and then decide. If you okay. don't like it, we can think of something else. Yeah. If you insist. But I. Do you have problems sleeping? Uh, Every night I yes. take pills for that. There aren't any left now, though. <laughs> In you know the what light I mean. of recent events, I think you should stay off those pills for. Okay. I suggest you drink some hot milk before bed. And I like milk. Would you describe for me how you feel at the moment? Pussy. The moment. Definitely bad. Good. Hopefully you can now move on from here. With a bit of luck you will So this guy is actually Dr. X. Suicide attempts often have that effect. Same as near death experience. It makes you realize that you're not Do you find it hard to No. No. I really. do at the moment with all the freaking talking. Alcohol? No. That's good. Alcohol <laughs> is a no. powerful depressant. I never really liked drinking. Excellent. Excellent. Sometimes Let's when have a life drink gets that. too much and people feel sad or upset, they think about suicide. Do you often think about suicide? Uh, well, don't you think about it? Susan, I'm a psychiatrist. <laughs> My job is to... Would you ask a fireman if he ever thinks about setting fire to his house? Yes. I suppose not. But I'm sure lots... I couldn't say, Susan. The statistics show that men are three times more likely than women to commit suicide. That puts nice. you in the minority. But of course, suicide is never the same. I realize I know. that now. Yes. Please, in your own word, okay. why did you really try to take... Nothing was making me happy anymore. I want to show everyone how hurt I was there. Nothing was made. There wasn't... I kept thinking... I tried to... All the, I, I, and I. Do you... Not it was... What? My what cats. Ever... What makes you feel? Dogs. Lo and yet, because they're a not all. Call it what you like. I'll sure be. Have you imagined your funeral? Probably. Can you imagine? Now that's a sad picture. No tears shed. I never like. Finally, I'd like you to tell Eric. Yes. Who's Eric? Your husband. Oh, what my can husband. You tell me about what had happened. Mm, it's getting late. Can we talk? <laughs> I. Hmm. Fine. Okay. Are you going to do it? That's a hard one. But hey, I've got it. The answer is no. no. I'm not. Thank. Excellent. There's just one more thing. I'm. What exactly happened last night? Well. After I'd met you outside the ward yesterday, I went back to my room and fell asleep. I slept really well, considering what happened earlier. But then some it was the same nurse who was so friendly with me the first night. We must go, Susan. You are not safe here. But please, you must follow me quickly. What? Huh? What's happening? I went after her. The war. Cat lady deception. Quiet. Cat lady and cat lady. Shut up. I was seen. Want to see the cat lady deception? Hurry. Shut up. Go 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 go. Wait go. for me. Go. Ah, there we go. Security guide. She pointed at the corridor and said, "You go first, Alex." Corridor. Go to. Oh. Huh. Susan, if we don't escape now, please trust me. I know a way out of here. Let's go down this corridor. Should I trust her? Exit. Accident and emergency. This is not, that's not the exit. I think I can hear someone coming. <gasps> Run. 
Oh, it's her. Haha. -ha. Well, she just went right through me. Damn it! We can't go through there. Let's turn back, Susan. But it said exit this way. God damn it. Turn left here. We can use the maintenance lift to get us out of this. Alrighty. Corridor go to. Where ah there we am. There we am, what? Button, call lift. Go. Let me out of here. Na, 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 I don't know the lyrics. But I just want to go here. I want out of this fucking hospital. I am so pissed off at this game. Something like that. Okay, go. On the... Shh. Liz. Shh. What the hell are you doing? And why is there blood on your clothes? Liz. It's quicker than the stairs. And besides, all the doors are locked anyway. This is the only way out of here. The only escape. Don't do it, Liz. Jump. It won't hurt. You'll see. This is a bad idea. Come down and we'll talk. I've made up my mind. I need to end this suffering now. Besides, I have no one to live for anyway. No one ever listened to me. No one ever cared. I listened. You're a nice girl. You have your whole life ahead of you. You listened. Did you really? <laughs> Not really, but still. You talk a lot, but I've always been a good listener. I liked talking to you. So do you remember that story then? The one I told you the other night? The one Damn. about the woman in A and E? Ah! Uh, no! I should have listened! A and E? What is A and E? I don't think you told me that story. Jumped off the roof and broke her spine. She smoked a cigarette and burned in a bed. The one who kicked the security guy. I don't know! I don't know! No, kicked the, the security guy in the crotch. The security guy in the crotch. You just made that up, didn't you? Yeah, I, I did. said such a thing. You're a liar. But. Okay, I can prove to you that I listened. Just don't jump, please. You can prove it. Fine, I'll give you a second chance. Did I, I should tell have you listened. about my flatmate? Did I tell you what one of them does for a living? If you really listened, you would remember know. this one. <sighs> okay, she's not a waitress. She's not a burglar, stripper, or stewardess. Flatmate. A flatmate. What will a flatmate be? Not a stewardess. She will be making a lot more money. Not a burglar. Because it's a girl. A stripper? She's a stripper. I don't yes. Know. Yes! Or at least that's what I think she is. You've listened. I just yes! think other people did. I'm sure they do. I guess it right. What do you know? Why do you care anyway? I... I don't want you to make the same mistake I did. I thought you of all people knew how it feels when you're trapped and you can't trust anyone. Look, I'm sure there must be someone who cares about you. My colleagues don't care, my family don't care, even my fucking boyfriend never cared. He said he needed to go find himself. Did I tell you when he broke up with me? Damn. She wasn't married. Birthday, Christmas Day, Valentine's Day. Uh, what's the worst? What's the worst to get done by your boyfriend? Is it your birthday? I think it is, right? I think it's her birthday. On your birthday. Do you really think so? You're a liar. Damn. You never listened to a single word I said. But it's okay. It doesn't really matter anymore. You didn't cause... I knew it was Valentine's Day. ...is suffering... I have to do this to be free again. No, Jump you don't. Me, Susan. No. Do it while no. you still can. No. 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 Get out of No. I 
guess I should have listened. After that, I went back. I tried telling people about Liz, but they all thought I was crazy again and didn't believe me. And you were absolutely sure you saw Liz jump off this building? You know, it doesn't matter. I just want to finish this and get some- Susan, I know Liz well. She wouldn't do something like that. As a matter of fact, I saw her this morning. She's fine. I'd like you to come with me and see her. Stop treating me like I'm crazy. Fine. I'll go. I don't even... The door is locked? I plan ahead, Susan. I had a feeling in my gut, and my gut's never wrong. I feel like I really got to know you, though. I'm very sorry you've had such a difficult life. I like your green eyes and your sleek cheekbones. You're a clever what? girl, Susan, but the sadness has poisoned you for too long. There is no coming back from it. For what it's worth, I would have let you go if it wasn't for Liz. What are you going to? Okay, W, T, F, why did the doctor stab us to death? I mean, it's a doctor. Okay, guys, um, on this note, I'm going to end it here, I think. Probably will cut it up a lot. I've been playing for nearly an hour, so, uh, but I will make one episode out of it because I've been running around a lot. But anyway, guys, thank you all for watching. I will see you all in the next episode. Goodbye. Whew.